What is up everybody? Today I am back again with Drug Dealer Simulator. So I, uh, after I had already recorded the last video of this, um, I got a suggestion s stating that I should probably go through and show how some things in the game are done. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now, and I can't remember who suggested that. Um, but thank you. Uh, the fact that people are starting to watch my videos is pretty cool. So I think that was, yeah, this is going to be the most recent one. Um, it is, okay, it is police hours. So let's start out with this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and store that money. I'm going to toss the backpack. So the first thing I'm going to do, because this is something that needs to be done, because it is Wednesday, Tuesday. Um, but it's about to be Wednesday in 12 minutes, game time. I'm going to go ahead and deliver the 2450G coat packages for La Bolina. And let's look at the map. So most of the deliveries tends to be in the southern part of the map here. Though every once and then... You'll get it in the northern part on the other side of the uh, highway here. And it's usually in the back of a pickup. I don't know if it's that way for everybody, but very frequently for me, if it's north of the highway, it's, it's in the back of a pickup. But anyway, we're going to uh, this place. This is like a locker, like a uh, tractor trailer. Not a locker, a tractor trailer. Uh, kind of out in the middle of nowhere. So we're going to go ahead and get that delivered first. Um, and it's good to do that at night. When you're starting out and it's like you got to deliver like maybe 10, maybe 10 50 gram bags. You can do it during the day and it won't increase your exposure or anything too much. But when you get up to delivering two briefcases full of coke it's really going to up your thing. So, and this is where it's been the last few times, this tractor trailer. So we just move that over and hit escape. And of course it won't confirm that we've completed the task. And that is because you cannot fit that much Coke in, oh God, into a briefcase. No, you can't. Olivia is a stupid... Mm, I see. Okay, I'm just going right back up here. And you want to do this fast. I've never had anything in a dead drop stolen, but apparently that can in fact happen. And we're going to put that briefcase in the briefcase storage, also known as the bathroom. And head back down. And instead of uh, going the more risque way, oh, maybe going the more risque way is the less risque way this time. Sneak in between here, go over here, and Drag and drop, 24, that's it. There we go. And now we get to meet Gustavo to finalize the deal. In other words, get paid. And the last time I got paid, I think it was 38 grand. If this game teaches you one thing, it's that there is a lot of money to be made dealing illegal drugs. I do not recommend that. <laughs> Don't quote me on that. <laughs> And we come over to the computer here and Gustavo ask for a meeting. Hi, can we meet? Yes, don't bring a bag. We'll have a briefcase. Blah, 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 blah. Finalize deal. Let's trigger. Oh, I was like, no, nah, I should only have one, but technically collecting cash is considered a task. So, and we're not going that way. We're going to jump over the fence here. And 
Use Q and E to peek around the corners. Of course, I usually step halfway out anyway. And we always get the cash from the same spot. So there's the two towers. Yes, we smoke. Turn around, walk, or run in this case. You can also, the sewer hatch, I think down there, or maybe a street over, will instantly transport you here. I always forget about that. But just uh, uh, FYI. So here's Gustavo. Basically, he's gonna, your money's in the suitcase. Thanks. We're gonna pick up the suitcase and go back. And let's see how much money. 46 grand. 46 Gs. That is a lot of money. So during there's cops so during the load screen you'll occasionally see it say don't move too much cash into your account it will trigger uh some red flags during the day don't at night it seems to be a bit more lenient hmm they're still there and it looked like they were coming back so we're gonna go around this building yeah they were crossing back over their own footsteps there. I should have looked that way. Oh, well, there's cops there. Shouldn't be seen by them if we cut over here. Back up. And we are golden. Toss that on the bed. Come over here. So what I'm gonna do this time is show you guys. So save game. So how much does this have? That's the 46. We're not. Let's let's take one of these. I think only has 10. No, maybe not. All right, I'll take the other 20, the one that fell. There we go. So I'm just gonna go ahead and deposit 10. You know what? I wonder what hap. Let's see what happens if I deposit 20, 20 grand. It seems like. Let's go to characters. So. Risk factor, green, good boy. Exposition factor, dope ninja. I like that name, dope ninja. Kinda, kinda cheesy, but kinda cool. Sitting on the fence with that one, not sure. Uh, whoop, just missed those cops. I'm gonna come over here. I always go to the same ATM, there are several, but I always go to this one. And, oh, every time you check your account balance you get charged i i'm i have 154 grand i'm not too worried about the five dollar charge <laughs> deposit so we are going to deposit all 20 g's and see what happens okay so i had 154 i should now have 174 and the big kicker though oops, wrong button now see nothing went up but in the upper right corner we are going to see a red alert and it usually takes a minute there it is too much illegal bank cash flow this affects your risk and exposition so it comes up and it says that but I keep hitting escape instead of tab see it it doesn't affect my exposition here now I have had a rate place rated before I think I said this in the first video but they stole my my plants but that was it and I that's I it was like a hundred and fifty dollars worth of s seeds basically if I remember correctly I can't remember how much seeds are but it, it was nothing so yeah um okay so we're back down to one task available uh, unlock all areas and hideouts and dominate the ghetto basically if you go through and buy all of the hideouts i haven't done that yet simply because i i kind of want to just play the game out um and it's it is kind of fun to just simply deal uh, i know a lot of people get bored with that with this game but i i kind of like it uh so we got yo sold so that's a cash pickup, and I clicked the wrong thing first. And another one with literally the exact same message. So now let's take a medium backpack, should suffice. 
probably take the small one, but yeah. So let me check this again. Yeah, see, still not, still not in the red or even the yellow. It hasn't moved at all. So I'm not too sure. Oh, I didn't even look at where these guys are at. I just saw two towers. So more than likely, yep. Got cash, gimme. Got the, you want the money? Yeah, I want my money. Oh yeah, I forgot to check my balance. Okay, so before I do anything else, before I forget, log in a bank account. And yeah, 174. So, and see there's that $5 charge for checking my balance. That, I've never had a bank do that, but that does sound like something a bank would do. I know if you use uh, a lot, oop, I don't want to toss that over there. If you use a, a bank other than your own bank, you get charged. This is real life, not in the game, don't worry. <laughs> so, what I was talking about before with this messing up, so you saw me mix the 10 to Coke mix. So basically it's a 10 to two ratio, but I usually do 200 and put in 40 of the uh, 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 baking soda. Which I'm down to five grams worth, so I need to buy some more of that. Uh, and I think I got an order, maybe another cash collect. Hi man, Gathering Clines would need some Colombian. Got 30 G. You know it. I don't know if I, I well I do, obviously. But I don't know if I have it pre-mixed. There we go. 89 of cocoa. So package. Do 30. And run this out to him real fast. We are going on the other side of the highway this time. So we need to get in position to throw our backpack over. There's two cops to the right. Shouldn't see us. Over here. Jump. I did not take the briefcase. Well, that's even better. I can just simply jump through. I didn't think... I thought I was still carrying the briefcase. My bad. Oh, that makes this deal very easy. Duck and hide. To all units, possible assault with robbery near the docks. Over. Did I just see mo something moving over there? Like a cat? I've never seen any animals in this game, but I swear I just saw a cat over here. Oh, and you can take drugs in this. Hey, come over here, Bill. Oh, God. You saw me from way over there, really, man? Really? Um, Alright, so in this predicament... Um, we're gonna wait for that signal and we're gonna go away. for the sewer and hope that I can hit F fast enough. Where the hell is it? Now, what will happen here is they'll probably end up trying to run all the way around, come through the opening that's down here, right about there. Yep. And he's running, so uh, I wasn't even sure he would make it that far. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into a building. Usually, usually that deters them, yeah. If you heard him, he said lost them. So now we got the fugitive thing in the top right corner. So that basically means that the chase is over, but... Um, if a cop 
if you get anywhere near a cop, you're done. <laughs> Police hours or not, it doesn't matter. All right, so while he's taking his jolly old time, we're going to try and sneak, sneak, now run back over to the sewer. And is there any cops around now? No. So, all right, so I'm just going to run over to this guy. Yo, at last, got the package yet. Here it is. And grab him quick! Oh my god, <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. He's getting away! Oh no! Uh, He's running away! On, get him! Yeah. Wait! Oh! Oh, it glitched out there. I thought I made it through. They got me during the transition of uh, going through the sewer. Um, $100 slap on the wrist, not a big deal. We had nothing on us, so that's fine. Sir, stop. So, no, Don't try no loss. Stupid. Oh, you and you don't try anything stupid. I'm gonna blind you with my light. Fucking patho. Hey, language. Alright, so go back home. Now, uh, the person that was asking, um, suggesting that I kind of show what's new and everything. Um, like I said in the last video, it seemed, I went through and it seemed like most of this stuff was under under the hood type changes but I am going to look at that again here real fast all right so it's saying something about lock picks now I've never carried lock picks usually if I encounter a locked door I can just pick it so I'm actually kind of curious about that um, what up I got the cash from the sales you got time I got time for money So, I'm going to go and check that out real fast. Um, wait, where are we going? Oh, okay. Nearby. Um, okay, so I can't open that. Uh, here's this guy. Want money. Okay, so I had already picked the lock on that. This is where I'm going to run into a problem trying to find new... Oh, so that specifically says lock. I wonder if these garages are ones that I can buy, though. Um, no, that's usually the message that comes up, if that's the case. Um, where's that? There's that one I can buy. Let me see what the message says when I try and open that door. So you can buy the, this. Oh, this one. You can buy this apartment. So see, that's what it usually says. Uh, that might have been one that I already hacked. Not hacked, picked. Or maybe that's the one you can buy. I can't remember. Either way. Uh, I'm going to go over to... Oh, see, now stuff's going up. But that could be because I got caught. Before. That might have been what did it. Um, I'm gonna, it did say that there were some new uh, new details added. The fence, the fences got updated. Um, some visual stuff got updated. Um, maybe I don't really pay attention to the fence enough. The fence doesn't look too different, but I don't really look at it that much. Let's go in here and see if I can buy some lockpicks. Okay, so if she doesn't have it, yeah, you beat it too. Um, the guy over near the club, hey, you stand still, please. Should have it. I doubt the furniture store would have it. All right, off you go.
see if this guy has it. Because this guy can also convert uh, money to Bitcoin or whatever it's called in this one, PTC. I need to buy something. Um, no. Uh, here's the, or yeah, instead of Bitcoin, Pitcoins. So you can convert your uh, currency if you want to avoid um, the uh, burden of having suitcases full of money. So uh, we got 2,820 Anas. Let's go ahead and buy that much worth of Bitcoin. Um, can only buy a max of 99? Really? All right, we'll accept. Wait, so what if... Can we do that again? No. So you're limited on... Buy, you're limited at 1,800. Hmm. That would be something that I would like to see them fix. Oh, yeah. Derp. Uh, I can head over here and check the uh, computer and see if that's an order or money collect. I killed my plants. Oh, because I spent the night in jail. <sighs> that sucks. Alright, so let's go ahead and... What up? Got the cash from the sales. It's not like I'm short on... I keep hitting uh, set messages red by accident. I keep... Um, I mean, this is not exactly much of a loss. I mean, I already have so much M uh, Mary Jane that I don't know what to do with it. So... I'm not going to necessarily complain about this. There we go. So, yeah, each of these... There we go. Let's go ahead and remove it. I always forget that you can just drag. I got caps lock on. Fix that H to a J. Ooh, and we got a new addict. He's addicted to the blue amp. And up, oh, there's still some in there. And let's drag these up. And get all of this dry. Ahead and plant is dead. So even though that hydrate option is there, it doesn't matter. Remove. Come on. Remove. No. Ah, there we go. Not sure if it's my mouse or the game, but pretty sure it's the mouse. Okay, so, got some, yeah, I got some seeds in here. I'll go ahead and, come on, get those planted, and there we go, there we go, and one more. All right, so. Hopefully I'll remember to come and get those, keep those watered. And let's check on this again. Exposition is 
kind of high, but still, uh, still nothing that I'm going to get rated for. And oh yeah, we're supposed to be. So after I pick up the money here, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a look at how to do some of the recipes. Small unit, possible assault with robbery near the docks. Over. You there? Come here for a moment. Are you carrying any drugs or weapons? Okay, you're clear. To all units, we have an aggressive, intoxicated individual on the station. All units, be advised. We have a possibly armed robber around Old Town. Over. Patrol requested around. Alright, so, as far as mixing goes, there are some basic ones, um, and you can, a lot of these are uh, available, I mean, you can just do a search. Um, if you look up recipes, you're going to see one called Blue Amp, which is what that one guy got addicted to earlier, which is 20 G's of amp, 4 G's of sugar, and 2 G's of ibuprofen. So... Uh, let's see, I do not have, oh, we do have some amp, and there's only 26 left. Now, I spell it without an E, but in the uh, recipe online, they do spell it with an E. It really doesn't matter. Uh, there's some coke in there right now. It's the 10-2 for La Balena, so we'll go ahead and add that, and uh, we'll package... Um, oh, let's do that real fast. Where is the briefcase? What is, there's $46,000 in that briefcase. There we go. So let's package 50 of that. We'll package 100 of this. And it has to be in 50 G bags, baggies. I have to exit lab mode to toss the briefcase. Okay. Get this transferred over. There we go. And so let's go ahead and make the blue amp, which does seem to work pretty well. You do tend to get a lot of people addicted. So it's 20. You're supposed to do 20 G's of the amp. So I have 100 here. So 20, 40, 60, 80. 100 so basically we're going to times everything by five so four grams of sugar that's going to be 20 and i probably need to grind that first actually i believe yep or powder it i should say so let's go ahead and do the 20. mill mill not grind you know you guys know what i mean Yes, too much illegal bank cash flow. Blah, 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 blah. That keeps... If you deposit that much money, that's just going to keep popping up. And I always forget that you lose a little bit. So we're going to transfer... Don't I already... I already have some sugar done. Oh, der. All right, so... So we added the sugar. Let's pretend that I just pulled it from there originally. <laughs> and 
two grams of ibuprofen, so that's going to be 10. I already have some done, so we're going to go ahead and add that. And apply mix. And I don't have a space there, so it's just going to be B-L-U-A-N-P. Apply. Now, I believe it was also in the first video where I talked about if you have the exact same ratio, but you mix it in different amounts, if it's still 10 to 2, but you do 120 instead of 240, it detects that it's a different mix, which I tend to find very annoying. I have not tested that with the new update, so it's possible that that is something that got fixed rather either in this update or one of the previous updates that I missed. So we're going to see what happens here. All right, so I should be able to add this directly. Um, we're gonna be one gram over, but, and that is what I'm talking about. Source is different substance, can only put one substance type to combine substances into one using a mixer. Same chemical in different form is also considered a different substance. But exact same ratio, different amounts, is also considered a different substance. So now this is something I tried before early on i was like okay well i'll just take this and mix it in with that well then what it does is it thinks that you only have very little amp and it thinks that this is not amp it doesn't see this as even being a drug so it's just like oh 26 grams of it was something else like sugar or something that just uh for argument's sake but it thinks that 26 grams of what should be you know like a 24 to ratio of a drug it's just like oh that's all something else that's not actually a drug and so you get people complaining so you have to be careful so what I learned to do is drag this over to a new container give it the same name the same color but we're gonna go ahead and drain this one first to selling to customers and uh, giving out as samples and what have you and I didn't want to hit that. So I'm going to go ahead and package. And let's do, we'll do 10 samples. I'm also going to show you what happens when you take one of these. Because it was forever before I realized that, yeah, I, I don't. How do I? Click and drag. Yeah. Only target. So, oh, that's right. Only one target singular pocket. What? There we go. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and take the blue amp. It. What? Okay. It's not registering it. Okay, let's try uh, let's try the Coke. There we go. So that's what happens when you take Coke in the game. <laughs> uh, what was I gonna do? Now this man it might have affected me a little bit. I cannot remember at all what I was gonna do. What was it going to do? Oh, pass out samples. Okay. 
So, yeah, the the controls get a little bit wonky as well. I think that's just because it changes your view perspective. Because if you notice, it kind of zoomed out a bit. So my field of vision is a little bit wider now. But everything's super bright. And your stamina... Like, I'm not holding down run right now, by the way. It looks like I am, but I'm not. You're always in run mode after you take coke in the game. So we're going to go ahead and give this guy a free sample. And, uh, you look for, when you go to pass out samples, you look for these question marks above people's heads. I got a present for you, buddy. We're going to alt one to drag one over. And let's see. The two towers is a popular spot to find people. Um, let's see question marks. Let's go over here to the stink. There we go. There's one. Who are you? Just your friendly neighborhood dealer, yo. Yeah. Um, oh yeah, there's a nice little nod to uh, Breaking Bad here. No one around here. By the way, it is a good idea to uh, actually have Coke in your quick use slot. Um, when you're planning on doing deals um, at night because your uh, vision brightens up and if you notice in the back when it just wore off it brightens your vision up and it lets you run a lot which is good for running the cops and we got another guy over here I also like giving out the samples to people around the two towers because it's so close that if they do decide to buy, it's not like I have to transport the stuff very far. Now, I was wondering if it's like she disappeared or something. Okay, no one back there. How is this going? Eh, my stuff's going up pretty high. Might want to deliver these last, uh, pass out these last five samples and then go into hiding for the rest of the day. I don't want to get near the cops because I do have stuff on me. Um, I do have my, my one thing up. Uh, let's see. Stealth. Let's go ahead and yeah, yeah. Let's do pockets. That leaves me one skill remaining, skill point. I have stealth up, which means that they're less likely to find something when they search me. But I'd still rather not take a chance. Ah, no, it's a shooting college. And that freaking voice always freaks me out. Uh, hmm. Not seeing anybody else over here. I'd have to cross over or under, I should say, the highway and pass out stuff over there, but I prefer to stay over here. Of course, you can always use this, but the price to use this that you have to pay the construction workers off for goes up every single time. So it starts off at like 200, then it's 500, then 1,000, it just, it goes up quickly. They, uh, they know how to extort pretty, pretty well. Patrol requested around two towers, over. Oh god. Now I'm just standing here. Let's see if there's anyone in the kennel. B11 and B12 requested 
I just ran past those cops. Apparently they don't care. They're not too worried. No one is ever really over here, to be honest. Uh, I guess I'll take a chance and run back by them. Oh, there's some people walking over here. Anybody? Anybody curious? Is oh god? There's a guy up here, kind of looking around. Oh, oh, wait! Now I see somebody with a question mark. No, I guess I don't. Rap, radical, anarchist poetry. Huh. Um. All right. So I'm not really seeing anyone else on this side. Um. And my exposition and risk factors are very high right now. Not very high, but they're they're getting pretty high. That uh, exposition factor is pretty... It's getting pretty bad. So, I'm just going to go ahead and place these down. And, uh... There's some crystal and fentanyl. Uh, fentanyl, you got to kind of watch yourself. That can kill people pretty easily if you add too much you know a lot similar to real life anyway um i think the next video i'm going to focus on showing off some recipes um, how to mix them how to avoid messing up when you get into this situation by making sure you always make the exact same amount every single time i don't know what happened there maybe i only did 20 four and two and i did that a few times i don't remember but Either way, that is going to do it for this video. Um, if you guys like it, give it a like. If you guys want to see more, subscribe, and I will catch you guys later.